this is the reference face and this tenon is two and a half inches from the top of this face. That's the measurement that I'm really concerned with. So that's the part of the tenon that I'm gonna start to work on first. So what I can do is I can clean off all the stuff and then I can come in with my combination square, make sure that the surface is flat and then measure two and a half inches down. Afterward, I'm gonna flip the, the temper over to make sure that the tenon is actual true one and a half inches thick. And I'm not so much concerned with the depth on the other side. The depth on this side is really the key.
we're drunk on next time. It's much better. Yeah. Yeah. You want me to start a new video? For sure.
What I'm doing here is that this tenon is supposed to be four and a half inches nominal. What it actually needs to be is four and a half inches minus an eighth, because the housing the actual mortise that's going into is supposed to be exactly four and a half inches. That way, this doesn't actually bottom out. So that's what we do for all of our tenons. We give a nominal measurement, and then we subtract one eighth of an inch for every tenon.